game is patching and it's taking forever, so let's just start and sit on the uh, the blank screen and wait together. Oh man, I'm sorry to sound like a broken record chat, but I am once again so tired today. Oh man, I need like a a really really good sleep. That's what I need. Just play the new Zelda that should cure your narcolepsy. I feel like the game is picking up a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm not gonna be like a staunch hater. I'm not gonna deny if I'm enjoying myself. Like, I I did a session today and I and I thought it was pretty. I had a pretty fun time. So, you know, let's. I don't know if it's gonna last, but it was pretty good. Have you done any of the story parts, Joe? Nope. Do do do. Maybe it'll be a 6.1 out of 10 this time. What did I give uh, Breath of the Wild? Was it an eight? I think I gave it an eight, didn't I? Thanks for the streams, Joe. You're very welcome. How about acid? I'm sure that'll wake you. Oh, dude, acid? Oh, dude. What? What? I, I shouldn't talk about that because this that's a bad topic. I don't. I don't really know what that is. It's still. It's still patching. D bring. All right. How? Oh, it's it, really. It, it's not paused at all. It's actually really just taking this long. You don't know what acid is? I know it's a drug. I don't know what it is i've said it before and people people don't don't uh don't believe me i'm a good boy N never done any of this stuff like is it a liquid is it a solid is it a gas like what do you do with it still in the vods but hope you have a good stream gonna miss jedi block thanks rose asher hope you like the vods is the metal gear solid marathon going to include revengeance i'm sure people have requested it due to the memes i've already played revengeance so it won't be included and not only did i play it i streamed it so you can go and watch that one already if you want to. That was my first uh, first playthrough that was streamed. Oh, word, yes, word to your mother, yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you play the DLC of Revengeance? I didn't know there was DLC. If it was included as normal, then uh, then yeah, I did. But if you had to select it, then I don't think I did it, no. Hey, Joe, how are you? I'm doing pretty good, but I'm really tired. Have you decided if we'll play Peace Walker or do we have to annoy you more? I think you have to annoy me some more. Man, I just don't, I don't give a shit about Big Boss. I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want a Peace Walker. Remember the older engine streams have awful audio, unfortunately, it's impossible to hear you. Oh, do they have some audio problems? That's lame. Maybe it's only when the game is loud. What's after Jedi? We're taking a, a short break so I can finish rendering the, the streams to go on YouTube. And then we'll be back with Gravity Rush 2 and Metal Gear Solid 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. We may also stream the NES Metal Gear games. And I think we're going to play Metal Gear Solid for the PS1, and then we're going to do Metal Gear Solid Twin Snakes. And we're going to have a uh, Spot the Difference event. As long as I can get it all working, we'll see. Is there a port of the original Metal Gears, not the NES one? Uh, I think there are PC ports of every Metal Gear Solid game, but some of them are not available currently. They were on um, GOG, and then they were taken down. I think some of them were on Steam, too, and they got taken down. All right, this is taking forever. It's still patching. Download 5.5 gigabytes, and then patch 127 gigabytes. And they go bit by bit. Did you not only play Slay the Spire and also stream it? Or not? I did, yeah. I streamed my first ever run of, uh, of Slay the Spire. And my second ever run of Slay the Spire. And my third and fourth. And I think we did five runs, and that's it. That's all the Slay, Slay the Spire we did. The EA app has a very bad system of verifying files. That's why patches take a lot. I tried to do some recording last night uh, with GeForce, and I tried to record my desktop, and instead of recording the desktop, it recorded the EA app. So, like, the computer was like, whoa, 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 whoa. That's the most important program running right now. We're going to record that when I hit the record button. So that's fantastic. That's getting uninstalled the second we're done with this today. Fuck that. Would you go back to Slay the Spire to try out the fourth character? I already have on my own time. I played Slay the Spire um, a fair amount on my own time <clears throat> since uh, we did the stream. I don't think I've played it in over a year, though, because that character's been out for a while, right? That character is fun, but um, a little too uh, big brain for me. I find that character very hard to pilot. Is piloting the right word? All right, let's see. Did I put my link out? I did on Discord, right? Yeah, I did. All right, cool. So let's... Uh start the game and see if we can play all right pilot is pretty mid and enter the gungeon true so true i just played the the marine i like the marine i, I played the marine so much that i can't really play as anyone else in that game except for one of the secret characters because i'm just used to my character being blue 
Hey Joe, we need your call specifically for this one. There's no rules in Jad's against murder, so would you consider it a personally bannable offense? What? Like if you found out someone on, like, in the server had done a murder? I mean, did they do the time? If they did the time, then they paid for it. I mean, I mean, yeah, I, th I think, I think so. That was pretty fast. I mean, it was fast for that system. It was slow. Or than it needed to be. Oh, yep. Yeah, proceed anyway. Proceed anyway. Proceed anyway. All right. Here we go. All right. When we last left our hero, we were trying to find Bode on this ice asteroid Imperial base. Because that's where he left his daughter. All right. That's what we're doing. All right. So game's on. We're running. That's, that's cool. What do your specialized see? ISB base structure. That's good. That's good. Well, how come you got to shoot through the red laser thing? Anyone else bothered by the fact that it's not green and we can still go through it? Because red so far has been like, hey, this is a force thing or, or an unlock ability that you can do, but you can't do it yet for like the whole game. Deed. Due to heightened security, this hangar is restricted. All traffic will reroute to tertiary landing pads for enhanced inspection until further notice. I can't remember what happened. Did we die? Due to heightened security, this hangar is restricted. All oh, we fell. That's what happened. I remember now. Until further notice. Oh no, we got we got glitch killed over there the Jedi exactly like that okay okay so I can't I can't kill him when I go through the man of council is turning on man of cheese. Stop the violence. What do you mean they're turning on? They're turning him on? Why Why would they turn turn on him? Doesn't seem very nice. Uh-oh. Civil War? Marvel shit. <laughs> Laser feet. Laser feet. Thank you, Poops McYolo, for the resub. Awesome name. Thank you very much, Poops McYolo. Hey, Jerry's. I'll get you. No alarms yet. Okay, do we need to move that one? We're trying to get there. I'm going to guess yes. Wait, is this New Game Plus? Yeah, we're playing on New Game Plus. Really? You can shoot through that, huh? We skipped, like, half the game on our first playthrough. So now we're doing it properly. What's this for? Oh, I can go up here and do it. Oh, that's what you're supposed to do. Oh, okay. Whoops. You will never escape door closed. All right, I think we should just run through there and open the elevator because this uh, this is very tedious when uh, we can die so easily. Can you recap the story now that you've played through it? Um, honestly, no, not really. A, a long time ago in the High Republic, dude. Um, uh, like uh, some some Jedi found a hidden planet in a rift that's really hard to get to that you need like like 
super high tech navigation stuff to do it and they figured it out and then after they did that somehow some some raiders came in and attacked them and then the jedi council abandoned them and now we found out about it and we want to figure out how to get there so we can escape the empire because apparently that's the only place in the galaxy that's safe from the empire because it's so hard to get to even though it, it doesn't really seem that hard to get to um but then we woke someone woke one of those old jedi up who then changed his lightsaber crystal to red because now he decided he's evil and and that's it really that that's the whole story i don't i don't really know what's like it's it's just oh my god it's just nothing what's your opinion so far on the content you skipped the first time through um i liked the vader fight but everything else about that sequence was actually bad so i don't know maybe it was it was worth it to skip I like the game the best when it's just letting me just, just run around doing shit. Wait, we fought Vader again in this game? Not only did we fight him, we killed him. Hey Anderson, hey Chad, hey, how's it going? Interesting, I personally hated the Vader fight. I really liked the Mountain Ob Observatory with Rick. Why did you hate the Vader fight? I thought the Vader fight felt like um, probably the best duel that this game series has had like it felt like we were actually saber fighting instead of just like bashing sticks against each other i don't know why maybe maybe it just because he was big i don't know but it, it just it just felt like uh like like a good one bro you didn't have purity on for the fight i played the whole other game and most of this game without purity first the only boss we legitimately didn't do like is uh is ravis I think I think I've seen enough of the, these games to judge. You turn period off. No, we were seer for the fight, so we didn't have it. And Dagon three. That's just Dagon again. Oh man. What's purity? Purity is uh, this perk: increased damage taken, increased damage dealt. It's a new game plus. Thing. Oh, did we get a new one? Hold on, patience. Life regen, using slow also fills some life. I don't have slow, wish I could slow. Minimum force regen, uh, parry timing, centered, push enemies, no interruption. Enemies in a small area are staggered when Cal is healing. Cal can only take one hit and not be interrupted. Perplexity, trendsetter, oh yeah, I remember that one, okay. You have slow, I do not have slow. I skipped it. Purity is the best item in Risk of Rain 2, which you should play. Nah. Nah. I saw some guy give a Reddit review of this game on Reddit. And uh, he was talking about the performance or whatever. And then he said, you know, uh, he, he likes this one just slightly a bit more than, than the first one. Um, story is still solid, of course. <laughs> and then went on to say that, that the problem is, apart from some of the bosses, the game is just really, 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 really easy because the parry timings are so generous that all you need to do is just stand around and parry and that's it. And I'm, I'm just reading this review and I'm looking at it and I'm like, okay, what difficulty are you playing on? Because you don't get to complain that the game is too fucking easy. And like, if you're playing on normal, like, what are you doing? Like, turn it up. Jamie, pull that shit up. Like, what, what, what the fuck are you doing? Like... That's what difficulty options are for. Are you guys not, you're, you're not allowed through this, through the, oh, you are allowed, okay. I disagree, normal is the first um, expected playthrough. No, I, I really don't agree with that. Unless you are somewhat new to games, you should know by now what kind of difficulty you should be aiming for, and you just need to like th like the game should be balanced accordingly. But I think you have a responsibility to um to know what kind of uh, difficulty you should be in, in these kind of games. What if I'm try then play on normal? Then then you know that's part of, that's a part of the judgment call you have to make. Unless you never play games, you never play games. You should play on easy, not normal, probably, right? Can you change it right here now? Oh, if you can change it in the middle of the game, that's like no excuse. If you're finding it too easy, just turn it up. Nothing wrong with playing on easy. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with playing on easy. Yeah, I'm not I'm not saying that. Sorry if you think I am, or maybe that's not addressed to me. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with playing on easy. Oh, 
Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Wrong. Hard difficulties all over the place for all games. Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts. Hard and Dragons Dogma Hard are completely different. Yeah, I, it's not. Okay, listen, 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 listen. Okay, why why are you like like nose in my face, dog? Listen, I'm not saying that it's a perfect solution. Just that if you've played a lot of games and you are finding a game too easy, or you're really good at a genre, I don't think you get to play the game on fucking normal when there's difficulty options and then say game's too fucking easy. Like, turn it up. I agree that difficulty options are not always uh, conveyed well or well implemented, but you still have to like use them if they're there, or you should use them, or if you don't use them, then you don't have a right to complain afterwards that it was fucking too easy. But if you asked me this two weeks from now, I feel like I would give you a different answer, so I don't know. I 100% agree that, that most games... Uh, is it most games? I 100% agree that, that a significant amount of games... There we go, saved it. Um, do have difficulty options that just make absolutely no fucking sense. In my experience, the um, the hardest... If, if there's more than three difficulty options, here, then the last one is usually fucking hell in balance. And it's kind of like that in this game. This game included, yeah, like the the parry timing on Jedi Master is is stupid. It's kind of, it, I feel like it breaks the game, not in a it's too hard way, in a it doesn't fucking work anymore way. Nice and quiet. Can't let Bode know we're coming for. Purity is way better, super hard difficulty than Jedi, than Jedi Grandmaster. I agree, yeah, but I don't think it's. It, I think it needs a couple tweaks. It's still better overall, but but it's not better for bosses. This is this is baby easy mode for bosses, as we Find saw. Something? Can you say the normal difficulty is too easy? What context are you are you saying that? If you were to say, look, I I played I played this on all difficulty modes and I understand these games really well. I think the normal difficulty is a little too is a little too easy and should be bumped up a little bit so people who are tr coming in on normal have a better experience. That I can get on board with. But saying, hey, I played this on normal and it was too easy, it'd be like, okay, well, why didn't you play it on hard then? Like, why didn't you turn it up? You can turn it up, like, like right here. Here you go. Let's let's do it. If you're locked into a difficulty mode at the beginning, okay. Now now I'm more on board with you saying that it's too easy. But like, if you're like God gamer that's been playing games for 25 years and you're still playing on normal mode and then complaining the game's too easy, then I think that's I think that's kind of your fault. Greetings, new friends. I used to try to play games on normal for videos to get a good baseline experience, but now I don't think I do that anymore. I just play on hard. Or very hard. You don't make videos anymore. Yeah, it's true. Yep. Yep. Sorry. The terminal. What is up with you, Gatsby? Bode's here, all right. Got a place in the officers' quarters. Hey. Oh, oh, sh. Oh man, they're wrecking shit, huh? Oh, don't need you in. Do you ever play games on permadeath mode? Uh, I can't remember the last time I played a game that had an optional permadeath mode and I played it on that mode. Your game has to be literally perfectly balanced for me to play your game on, on permadeath mode. Like, I am, there's no, yeah, Hollow Knight was the only one I ever did. Uh, or, or I did uh, recently, I think. So recently was like fucking like four years ago, somewhat recently. like. Your game better be like fucking flawless when it comes to if I when I die it's my fault for me to play permadeath mode. You're quick. 
What the fuck with the eye frame? Help. Even Hollow Knight, Hollow Knight is not flawless in that though. Um, I think if you if you're in Steel Soul mode and you go to God Home, you don't lose your save if you die in God Home, right? Because it's not technically a real fight. Is that correct? Because you don't lose your fragile charm if you die there too, right? Need to open this. But you get kind of like a little taste of the of the who the fuck are you? What of the permadeath experience when you do the Pantheon? So, like, if you watch the video, like, that, the glitch I saw on, on the very, very final boss, I don't want to say it because of, of spoilers, I want to say, say what it was, but if you watch the video I did on the DLC, then you know what I'm talking about, when, when the whole screen filled up with, with the stuff, and I said, you know, this, this is the fight over now because it glitched because I got too high, like, that happened to me during the Pantheon of Hallow Nest, like, on a binding run, like, that was really fucking annoying. So like, even Hollow Knight is not um, pristine enough, I think. This is Commander Dennett. Oh, they removed that bug, did they? That's good. Welcome our guests from the Inquisitorials. We are grateful that Lord Vader has shown an interest in our operations. We will continue to demonstrate that this view is to the Empire. Our enemies are new. got something to help me. There's the base commander. We will prevail. Be always watchful and stay vigilant. We are the Imperial Security Bureau. We are the eyes of the Empire. Oh shit! Okay, whoa. Oh, my bad. Okay, wh where are we going then? Do I run along the wall? Oh, right there. Fuck, I'm really bad at seeing these. Holy shit. Like Doom Eternal? Here we go. I don't see the benefit of playing Doom Eternal on Permadeath. What, what's, what do you get out of it? <laughs> oh, Jerry's, what are you doing? I've been hit. Why do you Not call him Jerry's? Because they remind me of Jerry from uh, from Rick and Morty. We've been doing it since the first game. I missed the answer about Doom, Eter Doom Eternal, sorry. I guess it's just the thrill that it could be over any second unless you play really, really well. Don't get me wrong, playing Doom Eternal on permanent death makes a lot more sense to me than playing Path of Exile on, on hardcore. Like, d playing Doom Eternal on um, on permadeath is like, that's not for me, but I respect anyone who does that. Like, if you play Path of Exile on Hardcore, I, I legitimately think less of you as a person. Because <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Like, just like, oh, just like one, one little ISP fucking hiccup, and you're just, like, fucking, like, hundreds of hours of your life just wasted. What the fuck? are you doing like and then like and you're oh no i'm taking damage trying to use my logout macro to save you like what like and like the fucking the director of the game saying that they balance the game around that now because so many people use it so now it's ruined for softcore too because oh if you're taking a lot of damage just like hit escape and log out like what fucking hell but yeah i get like doom eternal like, i can see the appeal i guess they what yeah like the if you're about to you die find? in Path of Exile in Hardcore, like, the, the go-to strategy is to hit escape and hit, and hit log out. And it will instantly log you out and you won't die. It won't count as a death. You'll, you'll just come back in, in, safe in, in, at town. Alright, where the fuck are we? Do you respect people who play WoW permadeath? I heard th about that. Uh, I think Weeaboo Bill was telling me about that. About how there's, like, some, some Iron Man... Uh, uh, World of Warcraft runs going on, and that sounds kind of interesting. But again, like I guess it's not as big a time investment as uh, as Path of Exile, and it's a lot harder to die in World of Warcraft compared to Path of Exile. So I guess it's okay. But still, like any online game where you're playing permadeath, um, unless it it has a quick turnaround on on uh, restarting, is wild to me. All right, what are we doing? We can't hit the button. We're not getting XCOM Iron Man. Well, that's like individual soldiers, right? That sounds like it could be a lot of fun and add a lot of tension. But it's not like, oh, one person dies, your run is over, right? So I can definitely see the appeal there. 
I am, uh, I am Cuphead tutorialing again. I don't know what to do. Do I go here? I'm curious if you've seen Thought This. I feel there has been a tendency in AAA games to have your flinch animations last 17 years, and it's really irritating. <laughs> I personally feel it in the new God of War, both Last of Us and this game. What do you mean by a flinch animation? Like when, um, like, like, cutscene, like there's an explosion going on? Or, or when you, uh, when you get hit? Oh, there's something up there. Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, damn. When you get hit? It takes a, b a bit, yeah. All security personnel, we've lost visuals on the intruder. Report positive ID to Central Command. I feel like I can get stun locked pretty easily in this game. Yeah, sorry, R2D2. Man, how does this like base layout make any sense? This is like a a Dark Souls level painted with the Star Wars aesthetic, isn't it? Loop back to the bonfire. Okay. It's so go. weird. Like when you stop and think about it, the way this game works with the Dark Souls level structure is just so fucking weird for this uh this franchise. I think it works in terms of gameplay, but does it work in terms of like fitting this this universe? Probably not, but I like it, but it's strange. That was my problem with the Vader fight. He'd hit you once, and you'd be stunned for so long. You get a sec, you get hit a second time. You can't do anything about it. Same in Last of Us. You get shot once, and Ellie would anime clutch her chest for so long that you get shot again. I don't remember that from Last of Us, but I tried to forget as much about the Last of Us as I possibly can. Um, Vader fight seemed like that. Yeah, I think so. I think you're right there, but I still like the Vader fight for how it felt outside of that. I didn't like his grab. His grab was a little, a little um, tracky. Little Dark Soulsy, little chained ogre. Guess a platform is somewhere else. <laughs> oh, okay. The boat grab in the final fight is also garbage. There's a lot of that in this game. That's garbage. But then again, there's a lot of that in every single Souls-like game that From has made. That's that, that's garbage too. Which which Souls game made by From has the least amount of horseshit in its like grabs and animations and stuff? Is it Sekiro or is it Bloodborne, or is it Elden Ring? It's definitely not one of the Dark Souls. It's it's Dark Souls one, two, and three have to be the worst for it. Actually, it's got it's got to be Sekiro, Bloodborne, El or Elden Ring. Sekiro so Sekiro is the best for it. Do you think? Yeah, maybe. Oh, we're dead this time. Mixed with the fact that he did unfair amounts of damage, in my opinion, Vader was the only part of the game where I felt I have to turn the difficulty down. You, d you didn't, though, right? You didn't? Like, you felt like like, like maybe you, you should have, but you, you powered through, right? With Sekiro, the Ogre can be bullshit, but not many other grabs reach those levels. I think that the Ogre has some bullshit for sure. I think the Ogre is probably the most broken enemy in the game that you're meant to fight. I think the most broken enemy in the game period is are the headless. We spoke about that last time. Um, my brain is telling me that there was something fucky on Ape, but like I would be hard pressed to tell you what what it is off the top of my head. What wait, what does this not do okay. So we don't get a dash through this one. Oh we do! Okay. What was what the fuck happened there then? Did I iframe through it? Fuck. Did he preload the shot, man? I actually went frame by frame on the headless animation and the damage is like 3-4 frames before the sword touches you. I too did that, Chatter! Oh man, me and you! Arm shake, here we go! Yeah, I also did that. You just awoken a memory in me of me doing that, yeah. It's complete horse shit, isn't it? I sure hope Joe's game doesn't have any wonky hitboxes. Right now it does. But you know, it's still... I don't even know what I would classify the game as right now. What comes bef the one before... before Alpha? Surviving 
pre-alpha. Yeah, before that one. Before pre-alpha. Oh, fucking hell. This room's hard with take with dying in two hits. You'd fucking see see over monster hunters plus Seoth. It's so bullshit. I think I've heard that. I think someone told me that. Okay, you know what? I want to finish the game today. Thank you for helping me, game. I think uh, Genichiro, I think that's his name from Sekiro, is one of the one of the coolest boss fights that I've had uh, experiences in game that I've had. For the fight going from kind of like this guy's fairly tough to I could beat this guy with my eyes closed, like just never, ever, 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 ever stop attacking. You know what I mean? Just like I just a complete fucking domination on this guy. It's a pretty cool uh, transition to go through. Ever thought of doing another Disco Elysium stream since it has full voice acting now? Yeah, I think that would be good. However, um, I, I don't know. I don't know who I was talking to of, of, of who worked on Disco Elysium, or I guess it wasn't someone who worked on Disco Elysium. It might have been, though. Whoever, someone involved with Disco Elysium copyright, at least, when, when we were trying to get the, the streams up on YouTube, but that left me with a really fucking sour taste in my mouth about that whole experience, let me tell you. It definitely wasn't a dev. Or at least I, fuck, it might have been, I don't know. But that really pissed me off. We're locked out. Like being told, like, yeah, we know what we know it was a stream. We know it we know it's it's pretty much fair use. We know this is a thing that, that people do. Like we we understand it, we we enjoy it ourselves, but but no, fuck you, you still can't do it. Like like what? And I also don't understand how YouTube, for whatever reason, I don't know if I just like got flagged by the algorithm for that one, or like though that team had like like the god agent that worked at YouTube or something, but like YouTube wouldn't even let me dispute that. Like YouTube itself was like, nah, we're we're not gonna let you do this one. It's like wait, what? Like why are you getting in between me and me and this? Like what the fuck? Like. This is the exact same reason I've given every single time. And every single time it's gone through and accepted and it's and the copyright claim has been cleared. So what's wrong this time, YouTube? Oh, playing like shit today. Two days in a row playing like shit. Wait, which, which video is that? Oh, it was a stream. The Disco Elysium VODs are not on YouTube because uh, of copyright claims. I got a legit strike because of that. Like a full-blown strike. I think it's expired now, though. Hey, BD. Do you hear what happened to the company? It's a mess. Only like a little bit in passing. Seems kind of fucked up. You have a shortcut now? Do I? Where is it? Oh yeah, the elevator. It's just not here when I come in. This is the one. This is the one. This is the one. I need help on another sim. Ah! 
No! Oh, man. Did he raise that weapon and his attack, like, started and ended in the whole time after I attacked there? That's another little pet peeve of mine in games. I am using the slowest weapon in the game, so I guess that makes sense, but it still fucking pisses me off. I think a lot pisses me off. <laughs> Random question, what kind of music do you like? Almost anything. I'm trying to think of what I've been listening to mostly lately. Uh, I've been listening to a couple of Carly Rae Jepsen songs. Am I saying her name right? The Call Me Maybe Girl. She has a lot of other songs that are pretty good. Um, been listening to Tom Cardi quite a bit. That's about it really lately. What's your take on electronic music? I would be hard pressed to, to name any electronic music that wouldn't be like a subgenre that I'm not really clear about, but uh, I think I've heard some electronic music that's really good. Do you like punk metal? Not a lot, but I'm sure there would be some of it that I would like. Like bad religion, that kind of that kind of uh, genre. Some of that I like, yeah. What are those moving laser walls for? Just to add difficulty to the, to the encounter. I don't know what they are for, like in terms of like functionality for the facility. Oh, oh, it's a cutscene. Greetings! Alcestis. I'd assume the first time we met you'd be strapped to an interrogation chair. I've heard that before. Still weird. Get on the comms and call off the base alert. Or what? You're a Jedi. I know what you're capable of. And what you were not. Just mind trick him, man. On the comms. Now. This is Commander Denvik. The Jedi has been neutralized. All units stand down until further notice. Satisfied? I'm here for Bo to Kuna. How did you find this place? A locator beacon on Bo's ship. I'm characteristically careless. His reports indicate you two have grown quite close since Coruscant. Oh, so he is working for the Empire. You're the one who sent him to infiltrate my team. Correct. The oh, whole time. Weapon for some time. The whole time. Effective. Unlike those armored abominations in the Inquisitorias. So it's true. Seer's dead because of you. No. The Jedi operation is still months away. You're lying. The Empire burned the archives, led by Darth Vader. Lord Vader. I have to stop this while I still can. Wait, what? Don't you see? Bo lured you here to destroy me. They're coming. Dead man. I don't understand what's going on. Huh. Oh my God, he's dead. Yeah. Wait, are we gonna dress as him now? No. 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 No, though. No? Surely everyone in the base knows who's in charge. Is Wasn't there like a giant hologram of him? Is it like a rule now that every Star Wars media has to have some like super awkward, wouldn't make sense like stealth disguise mission? Boat's well, gotta go through do, us do, to get do, to his do, ship. Do. Let's hurry. Do, 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 do. If anyone sees you, it'll blow her disguise. Okay. So, so stealth? What? Okay. I don't know where we're going. Can we inexplicably open the store now? Oh. I don't know why. When we got here earlier, I thought Cal put that thing on the door. Good thinking, BD. See you on the other side. Alright, see you later. Where are they interrogating the Jedi? 
Why? Greetings. You want to crack at him? That's right. Do stormtroopers possess resistance training that I don't know about? That's only for the feeble-minded. Yes, that's exactly my point. Hey, Jerry. Hey, Jerry. He's not answering his comm. Try again. Maybe he's interrogating the Jedi. You think he's still alive? Dendik said neutralized. He didn't say dead. Yeah, fair enough. Not so easy to capture one alive, though. He looks familiar to you? Yeah, a little. Hey, what's up? All right, then. Which way to the officer's quarters? A new recruit, I take it? That's right. Well, it doesn't speak highly of you to be so unaware of your surroundings. Now get out of here. I don't have time for you. Thanks for the warm welcome. Another word, and I'll report you for insubordination. Didn't we kill an officer earlier in the level? Why didn't we just take his outfit? Oh, I guess BD didn't have that idea. consorting with the likes of you. Well, it was a little cut with lightsaber. Yeah, but we didn't need to use lightsaber to do it. We could have just uh, force some um, slammed him. Is nobody seeing this? Nope. Incredible. It's quite the play for Dendrick. Beating the Inquisitors at their own game. Don't let our new guests hear you saying that. Guests? <laughs> They're watching us. Oh, of course. And we're watching them. <laughs> And they're watching us watching them. But don't worry, we're watching them watching us watching them. We're one step ahead. Uh-oh. Lightsaber detected. State your business. I have an appointment. And what is the nature of this appointment? I have more blue stripes than you. Move the fuck aside. That's classified. I have clearance. Central Command should have called that in. I'm going to have to call in a security droid. Stay right there. Send down a security droid. Is this necessary? I can't make an exception, even for someone of your rank. I'm late as it is. Understood. It'll only take a moment. We'll clear this up shortly. All right. Just F11 out of the room. I don't think I can. I can dodge right now. I told you, sir. There's nothing I can do. Protocol is quite inflexible on this count. The droid will arrive momentarily. Stand by. All right. Talk to Purge Trooper. All right, let's go talk to Purge Trooper. <gasps> Why are there Purge Troopers on this base? I was wondering that myself. I imagine it's because Commander Dick. This is giving me really big Oblivion vibes. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Dick's been so successful rooting out terrorist cells. So the Inquisitorius views us as competition. <laughs> That's right. All right, we talked to him. Hold on. Hold on. Why did the Inquisitorius send you here? Because the ISD has failed, so we must do your work for you. I suspect the ISD has been infiltrated by terrorists. Maybe you're one of them. What was that? <gasps> oh, no. Good music, though, huh? I told you, sir. There's nothing I can do. Let me through now. I can't. All right, I think we're over. Without security clearance. Oh shit! Let me through, or I'll report you Hit to the button for insubordination. I must let you through. Go on, officer. Oh, yep. Yeah, here I go. Oh, yep. Yeah. Running late. Thanks for having my back. Be ready for anything. Nice teleport there. This looks like a fighting room. Slice it. BD1 or Mimir? I would take BD over Ragnarok Mimir, but uh, 2018 Mimir is the best. He's not here. Let's look around. 
He was gathering intel on us the whole time. Why'd he give us the gun? All a part of the plan. Mama. Easy, sweetheart. I know. It's just me and you now, Kara. Hmm? Just me and you. Ode's daughter. And her mother. Okay. Bode and the daughter have some creepy ass smiles there, huh? What the fuck? Oh, he really is a Jedi. He has a meditation spot. Come on, buddy. What didn't you like about The Last of Us 2? I can't tell you that without going into spoilers. Uh, Nakey Jakey on YouTube has a video on Last of Us 2 that is very similar to my thoughts on it. So if you want to go watch that video, you can get a general gist of my, of my opinion on Last of Us 2. Last of Us 2 to me is one of the most expensive wastes of times, wastes of time that has ever been funded in any media ever. Not just in terms of money, but also like the man hours and the artistic like like you know uh power or investment i don't know what you would call it like a lot of really 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 talented people worked on last of us 2 and poured their heart out and like probably just like literally bled and lost so many months of their lives like their longevity crunching the shit out of that game you know for an experience that at the end of it is just like oh, okay whatever like you just fucking waste of time What kind of blanket's that? Data disc. Looks ancient. Let's see what's on it. But it looked cool. It did. It looked gorgeous. That game is really, really impressive. What do you think about Last of Us 2's gameplay? Not a big enough evolution on Last of Us 1, which I think actually has pretty good gameplay. Last of Us 2 did not have the kind of evolution that Uncharted 4 did going from Uncharted 3. So while it wasn't like horrible, it was okay. It was just okay for for most of the most of the runtime. In fact, Last of Us Two is similar to how I feel about Tears of the Kingdom's uh, combat, where it's like, okay, Breath of the Wild, I I could enjoy the combat. It was new, it was fresh, uh, for the series, a little clunky, but you know, I, I can have some fun and flexibility with it. And now Tears of the Kingdom, it's like, wow, okay, it's it's just that again. Awesome, like like really disappointing. I don't know what you would do in Last of Us Two though to like spice it up you can't give him a hook shot unless the hollow that Dagon was watching where the hell did you Sorry. come from I you scared me you must be Kata I'm Cal and this is BD1 Nice to meet you. Where's your dad, Kata? He said to pack for a trip. That's a cute bag. You don't work here, do you? No. Wait, do you have the lightsaber on your hip, Cal? Figure that out. Yeah, he says with the lightsaber visible. Are you really a Jedi? Yeah, ooh, what? <laughs> yeah. Well, I've finished packing. I can't find my Mookie doll. Uh, yeah, I'll help you find him. Objective, find the Mookie doll. Oh, jeez, Cal, I can't find the doll anywhere. Turgle failed, Kata. Is this Mookie? <laughs> kind of looks like me. Little. My mama gave him to me. She's dead. Kata. Did your dad tell you where he's taking you? It was supposed to be a surprise. But you got here a little sooner than I expected. Come here, Kata. Papa, what's going on? This is my best friend. 
We had a fight, but we'll get things settled. When we go. Yeah, why not? Found Luki. You were a Jedi? Yeah. How'd you survive the purge? How'd you? The Council assigned a few of us to intelligence during the Clone Wars. I used the skills that I learned there to disappear. Went into hiding, didn't know who to trust. Familiar story. Right. But then I met the most incredible woman. Your mama. She was a Seth. One day, Kata and I were out running errands, and I got this message. Don't come home. Inquisitors. Looking for me. My wife bought us the time to escape. Is, is this whole section just establishing main villain out of nowhere backstory before the final confrontation? Okay. I knew I couldn't run forever. And so I cut a deal. Oh. Then Vic keeps us hidden. As long as oh. Papa stays useful. You were lying to us from the very start. Yeah, no shit. Not all of it was a lie, though. Lord was a way out for both of our families. But you were gonna give it to the hidden path. <laughs> a, a, a bunch of strangers. Really? You were sacrifice thousands That's of people why? to save yourself. We're a monster boat. Father. The first time I held her, I saw the entire galaxy in her eyes. <laughs> you can't understand. I understand betrayal that you lured me here to take down this base. This kid is just a prop right. for this scene. Well, fighting the Empire is what you do best. Run, run. The intruder is in my quarters. He's armed, shoot to kill. Kill that Jedi. Yeah, I got here as fast as I can. I don't know where he went, but probably that way. I got his lightsaber. Boat. Get out of my way. L S R S. Press to have Cal embrace his darkness. We have that move already. It's called L. It's called LT and RT. We have that already. How is that embracing the dark? It's embracing the Jerry's. It won't let me do it again. The shots are off off screen. It's LSR. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing that. It's not, it's not working. Oh man, 
carries to the deep. Hey, BD. Oh shit, what the did they did they practice this? Is it choreographed? Is this an Olympic sport in the Empire Olympics? Like what the Door stay unlocked at least. Okay, this is gonna be rough without the alt. W the alt is just the big force pull. What do you mean? Or do I not have the alt that I'm supposed to have because uh, because we skipped four slow? Oh man! All right, so we need to run through. And then in the second room, we need we need to okay. We want the um we want the this saber on. All right, we want to run through. All right, we want to run through. Okay. Then we reset our block here. We run through. <laughs> Who, who, who's shooting you? All right, you don't follow out. Toss this. This way. We we never use this this room. All right, this is the we go this way. We break this open. Oh sh shit! Need a stim. Alright. Alright, we're down to one stem. Oh, I see you, Jerry. I see you. Screw you, Jerry. You know what? Maybe not screw you. Oh my 
my god. go can't use this lift yet shit all right no stems no stems we're done right there's nowhere else to fight <laughs> oh no ah! Ah! <sighs> okay that was kind of weird what was his, like, I I'm coming, but fucking hell, really? Hold on. Now we can just run through, though, right? <sighs> what does the dark side do? It doesn't work because we skipped getting slow at the beginning of the game. All right. I don't think we can skip these because they're flamethrower dudes, right? What? What? Why wouldn't you grab on? What? Hey, Jerry's. How's it going? Pretty good. Working harder, hardly working, huh, Jerry's? All right, see you later. Big gulps, huh? All right. Away, he's gone forever. Hey, Merritt, you hear that? Merritt, where'd she run off to? Destroy that fighter. Oh, let me meditate. All right, we got through it. Late. We got through it. We gotta get back to the mantis. Inches restored. Hey, buddy. Hey, BD. Fuck, I didn't even see the, the, the bolt come out of the blaster there. This is this is not the way. This is not the way. What's the way? Is it that way? Is it past the TIE Fighters? Is that the way? Okay. Help BD! Is it just you're just gonna do it as soon as you look at me now? Alright. Need an assist. <sighs> Sorry chat, this is really hard. Kinda of fails the missed ability. Oh for sure, yeah. I'm trying not to use uh range attacks here? too much to, to cheese it, but think? maybe we're gonna have to. Do I think the dark side of the forest makes sense? No, not really. What? Hey, BD. That's not who I was... I wasn't aiming for him. I was aiming for the other... 
the guy just got his fucking posture down. So the um, jumping uh, ground wave attack that this uh, lightsaber does, like, just works when it wants to, huh? Oh, I finished that Sudoku today, uh, and I gotta say that might be my new favorite, or it's at least in the top five. Shenanigans by by Jay Dyer. I think it was on Cracking the Cryptic last week. That that was a fucking banger Sudoku. Holy shit, was it good? It was really hard though. I don't know if most people find it hard, but I found it really really hard. Will there be Sudoku hacking mini games in your game? Nope, there won't be. Maybe the next one after that. All right, we can jump down an ambush, right? We can jump down an ambush, right? Right? We can jump down an ambush. We can! Oh, wow! All right, we did it. We did it. World first. We're done. Oh, shit. Deacons of the Jerry just keeps going. Alright, Marin, you said you want to rescue me? You go for it. Good luck. Thank you to, uh, for the resub from uh, Chitalian. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Chitalian and C. Haha. -ha. Thank you very much. I'm coming, Marin. I'm coming. Yes. From the sidelines. The kick. Shit. Undershot. Yes! Alright, again? Yeah! Wait, what the fuck? What? Okay, why can I only sometimes uh, chain parry? Uh-huh. You're so good at it. What if we jump down and then jump down again afterwards? Could we get could we get down there? Need a stim. Help BD. So is this game harder than Sekiro? It's harder to play than Sekiro because the controls are not as good, but um, I don't think it's harder than Sekiro now. Yeah, you're right, Chatter. Better with you lock on. damage is crazy. That's because of the, the purity charm. It's not supposed to be like this even on Jedi Master. <laughs> what the fuck? You just immediately just go into twirl mode? What the fuck? <laughs> force sensitive inquisitor. Maybe they are force sensitive. I don't know. Joe, how is that my fault? Are you uh, trying to not use the super move? I can't use it because we skipped getting force slow at the beginning of the game. 
So I, I, I cannot use it. Look, I'm, I'm trying right now. It won't let me. Are you meant to have a weapon in your hands? Woo! Woo! What the fuck was that? Oh, we got a skill point. That's good. All right, just a bunch of Jerry's left. Marin, you can handle this, right? Marin, are you even capable of doing damage to these guys? All right, did you kill one? No. Oh man, Jerry, that, this is a tough fight, isn't it? Jerry? Jerry? Uh-oh. Oh, she is too- Oh, you have a gun! Oh, okay, cool. Alright, Marion, can you kill one? No, you can't. Alright, we did it. World first. I don't know if I can do that, chat. I don't know if I can do that. Please just let us run away. There's no fucking way they do rockets and shit, don't they? Oh no. Fuck. But they also do they also do blaster shots, don't they? Charge blaster shots. All right, I don't know if I can do this. I legitimately don't know if I can do this. Like if I, if all they do is rockets, I can force push them back in, that's easy. But I thought um, one was doing a blaster shot at the same time as a the rocket there. I don't know if I can do this. Just spam the down smash. It uses force, I can't. I already spent all my, uh, all of my force there at the end on that, that attempt. during a solid break. Hasn't even been two hours yet. Why are you here? Wait. Alright, there's no number what next to your think? name. Never mind. I'm rescuing you. Alright, that worked out. What? Sorry to cheese chat, but I've had enough of this. Oh shit, they're here already! Ah, fucking hell, I even turned around to do the force push. When when did they when did they come then? Alright, do they spawn after this wave or what? What the f Oh, lucky are they here now, right? No, still no. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Hold the phone. Hold the God. Here we go. Here we go. Do a rocket. Do a rocket. Do a rocket. Do a rocket.
Eclipse is doing nothing to them. Oh, it was a fucking blow. Oh, man. Oh, fuck. Maybe use the forget the forbidden dark side technique reduce the difficulty no jitsu. It's weird, isn't it? Doesn't say first time chatter next to your name. Oh, bad input there. Bad input there. Instead of doing the uh, the ground thing, he did um he did his uh, ground Y, and then I have to dodge the other attack, and then into the charge. I just got fucking super fucked there. After a bad input. Um, the, my fault. Not bad input. Like the like the game misread. I think that's my fault. Why is difficulty reduction off limits, but you stance changing is okay? What do you mean? Like difficulty options is kind of like a like Why a meta change here? of the gameplay, right? Where stance is like an option within the game. Mostly it depends on what's fun. Is this fun though? It's kind of fun, yeah. I like beating my head against a against a brick wall chat. Sometimes literally, as we saw in this playthrough. Need a stem. Fucking hell. Oh, they're all on me. This is bad. This is bad. Why do you sometimes take no damage, uh, robot? Really? I don't even get a cheeky free, like... A bitch right now. Oh, I feel like such a bitch right now. Alright, we did it though. Alright, now time to fight Bo 2. And if you die, right back at the beginning. Where's Bo? They're gone. He took his daughter and the compass. They used me as a distraction. Damn you. Wait. Go on, Jedi. Another uniform? Do it! Do it! Rather you than Lord Vader. He should he should be wearing the poncho, man. Who is this? He sent boat after our team. My crew. Cordova. Mm. Seer! Mm. They're all dead because of him. Cal! Mm. This is what Boat wants. I know you are in pain, but this is not you! The Empire has taken enough from us! I will not lose you two! Is Cal even capable of dark side? Like, come on. He won't. <laughs> See you on the Mantis. <laughs> Give the Inquisitors my regards. <laughs> I'm all right. I'm fine, buddy. You don't have to worry about me. Can you imagine if I had dashed in on that last robot for a melee swing to finish it off and then just got sucker punched right in the face? Oh, that would have been bad. Hey, Marin. Are you alright? Yeah. 
think so. What was that? Was it... I don't know what that was. If you feel it again, you will tell me. I will. Good. BD looks ready to head out. Oh, finally, I was worried sick. Wait, don't tell me. He was fighting the entire base, wasn't he? You are right. Okay, Cal. We got no boat. We got no compass. Now tell me the truth. I can take it. We lost that. One compass remains. Oh, okay. Where is it? I don't, though. But if the compass is gone, do not despair. What's this? This oh, isn't no. just last goodbye. There is another way to reach Tanalor. Activate the arrays and align them to the coordinates embedded in this message. Wait, what? There's a control center here. If we align the arrays, we can create a flight path through the abyss. Oh. Wait a minute. Let me get this straight. You want me to fly the Manus through a ship-eating nebula using a tiny tunnel carved out by 200-year-old tech? Yep. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Uh-uh. Okay. Right, I'm in. Yep. Mm. <sighs> Honkai Star Rail has better writing than this. I gotta go somewhere. Convince me. Oh, dude! Honkai Star Rail stream playthrough? Dude, oh! How can we be sure this experiment's gonna work anyway? We cannot. <laughs> so we start up some arrays, whatever those are, punch a hole in the abyss, and then fly through? Yeah, that's pretty much it. We're gonna take a break as soon as we land. We're at two hours, I need to pee. You mean stream along of auto battles? Yeah, I tried to do World 3 of the Simulated Universe today on auto. And, like, I beat everything, like, no problem until I got to the last boss, and, and then in, on phase three, he just wiped me out. He put I something on, like, the whole team that I couldn't do damage to them. I don't know what the hell was going on. I, I was just watching the auto, like, the auto AI just, like, do nothing for turns and turns and turns. I was like, oh, I could help, but I'm not gonna. Like, I, I don't know what the hell you're supposed to do there, and neither did the auto battler, apparently. Jepard, yeah. You hit the Jepard wall? Yeah. Oh, Poncho's back! Nice. Well, hopefully the the auto battler AI figures it out, because I'm certainly not going to play the game. Fuck that. All right, so now we go into the the array, and that's it. How do we open it? I hate this dude bit. It got old for me already. Oh, dude, you don't like it, dude? Oh, dude, bro. What if I had a bro to it? Does it make it better? Is the writing here better than Forspoken? It's it's Forspoken tier, I think. Yeah. That whole thing that, that, that Grease just said was just classic, like, so wait a second. You're telling me that I can fly? You know, like, like I'm fighting jacked up beasts. Like, it's the same thing. Like, it's, it, yeah, it's the same thing. It's the same thing. Anyway, let's take a break. You think I'll find Ghost of Tsushima interesting? Um, I wouldn't be adverse to trying that out for a couple streams. It's open world though, right? So I don't really like playing open world games on stream. This is about as open world as I like to go for, for streams. All right, let's push the main quest some more. Whoa, let's push the main quest some more and see what happens. Because I'm curious if we have to like go around this area and go for a scavenger hunt. So I gotta say, now that we're, now that we're at the point that we skipped, the game is surprisingly small. Like it's just two planets really. It's, it's um, Kobo and then Jetta. And Kobo is like significantly larger than Jetta. So it's like big, big main planet to explore, secondary planet that's you can explore, but only in one main area. And then linear with offshoots, linear with no offshoots actually. Um, sorry, whoa, whoa, linear with offshoots and then linear with no offshoots. And, and that's that. So I don't know, kind of kind of unexpected. I thought there was gonna be like another planet like Kobo somewhere. And I, I think that's probably too much to ask, but the way it kept like throwing different bounty hunters and stuff at me, I was expecting that to, there to be another another big planet to run around in, like Kobo. A lot of chatter on the comms, kid. How you doing? Just reached the control center. I'll let you know if I run into any trouble. Welcome. I am Centauri Kree, the director of this experimental facility. 
Safety protocols require one person to remain here. Can I ask if you've heard about Street Fighter 6 and what they're doing with the single single player campaign? Yeah, sure, you can. Oh, yeah, sure. I'll ask around. See if anyone's got a death wish. Oh, see, this one's green now and this one's green too. Okay, so we have to find these three to get through, it looks like. Uh, I don't give a single shit about Street Fighter, sorry. I'm, I'm not into fighting games and that sort of thing. So you're not gonna get a good answer from me, sorry. I, I, I just, I'm just not interested in them. Oh, you're supposed to do this first. Oh, that's interesting. Fucking hell. Joe, that was snippy. I'm sorry, it was meant to be funny. Cause he, cause he answers no, cause I don't know anything about it, so it's just meant to be funny, I'm sorry. But that was poorly judged. Did he just cancel a red attack? Wow. Okay, I don't know what happened there. Tears of Kingdom already over? Yeah, we're not streaming anymore, I don't think. Although I do want to play it some more right now. I had, uh, I started... I did a, I think an hour last night and an hour this morning and uh, last night my play session was pretty boring but the one I did this morning was pretty good. I think I understand more what they're trying to do with the game now and I disagree with some of it but um, a lot of it I'm, I'm digging. I just wish the combat was better. Sometimes when I play a game, um, there's a moment where something clicks in my head and I'm like, oh shit, I think I understand what they're trying to do now to, to, to potentially talk about this in a video. Even if I don't make a video on the game, like that happens no matter what. Like I've had like, I've had this experience like dozens and dozens of times for, for games I've never made videos on that I've just, just played on stream or I've just uh, played on my own time. Um, and I, ha I think I had that with like, like Tears of the Kingdom um, this morning with what they're trying to do with how all the, all the different systems that they have in place are trying to constantly like push you into like like you know the the improv philo philosophy of um of uh maybe I shouldn't say this because then someone's going to go make the video that happened with Ragnarok I think there was like a video I found and it was like almost word for word shit that I said on stream it was fucking weird um anyway uh <laughs> I shouldn't have said that shit um anyway uh it's do you know that that concept of uh of improv comedy when um uh, yes and like, no matter what happens, yes and. Uh, it seems like all the different systems in, in Tears of the Kingdom, much more than Breath of the Wild, are just trying to facilitate this idea of, a, like, there's never a point where you're look, looking at the map going, all right, I, I don't know what to do, I don't know where to go. It's just, just like, I, ideally, you're never even going to have to use teleport even. It's like, you're just constantly, like, funneled into the next, like, okay, I just, I just finished this area, and I already have the next area that I'm going through just organically appear in front of me because I used... Ascension or I used a a, um, a Tower that fl flung me up in the air and I saw a floating island and I went down the floating island like like stuff like that Thank you, Lou. you know, so like I, I feel like that would be the the, the hook of the um, of the, the video where I'd be explaining like what I like about the um, uh, The game and what uh, how I think it's working Oh my god I mean, that's kind of just what the platonic uh, ideal of open world design is, isn't it? Yeah, but it's how Breath of the Wild pulls it off is better than... Oh, sorry, how Tears of the Kingdom pulls it off is better than um, probably any other open world game that I've played so far in terms of how organic it feels with just, like, I am being pushed and funneled into the next thing, next thing, next thing, go, 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 go. Like, e even the, the, like, the unlocks of, of the area, getting the map, like, using your abilities, you just finish a dungeon. Instead of being teleported out and then looking around, what am I doing next? You use Ascension to get out and then you're just immediately looking around oh, where am I what's the next thing to look at it's 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 done very very well so even though it's like it's not like a, a new idea or a new or a new ideal um it's done to a very high level with uh, some some creative mechanics and uh and like uh, Ubisoft power unlocks that sort of thing that's what I mean I felt that way first time playing Elder Ring ah! <laughs> ah. I hate these guys so much I feel like I could never safely attack the dual wielding baton guys. Is it worth going back to Breath or start with the new Zelda game? Uh, if you bounce off Breath of the Wild, it's unlikely but not impossible that you're gonna like Tears of the Kingdom. I think that they changed enough about how some of it worked that it's possible that someone who didn't really mesh with Breath of the Wild would like it. But if you hated Breath of the Wild, I don't think there's anything in Tears of the Kingdom that's gonna convince you otherwise. But if you were kinda on the fence, it's possible that Tears of the Kingdom could really strongly win you over. Oh, oh, okay. All right.
I hit dodge and I was locked into a to uh, a deflect on another blaster bolt that came in at the same time and it wouldn't let me. Fuck. I should have dodged sooner. Shit. <laughs> Why are you firing at the wall, Cal? Look what is it him and the camera? Didn't doesn't he have specifically have an animation where he'll shoot like fucking behind him? If he has a target? Okay, I feel like Joe just wants combat. No, I'm no, I'm I'm trying to win it. I swear to god. I really am this bad. I was trying to do the um, the vortex move, and instead he just did. I don't know what he did actually. I hit both triggers, and he just did something else instead. I don't know what the fuck that was. No, I meant what dictates switch from Tears of the Kingdom to this. Oh, um, well because we were already playing this, and also I don't think the Tears of the Kingdom streams are going to be very fun, and I, they're already getting kind of boring. Uh, I think for for some people toward the end of the the ones that we did, and also the Nintendo fans are fucking deranged. Like, did you see the guy who? Who told someone in chat yesterday that he should have that he was like uh, prematurely born because he was criticizing the Tears of the Kingdom? Like that 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 didn't happen to me. That happened to someone in chat who just said the game probably could have used some more Q and A time. You know, like, like Nintendo fans are fucking deranged. Wasn't that you? No, that was someone in chat saying it. I'm hit. What the fuck? Did that do anything? So he comes out with a charged blaster shot already going, but there was a juke, but I dodged, and because I dodged, I missed my shots, and then immediately after that, there's a fucking lightning grenade that I have to dodge on the floor, which I dodge into blaster fire and die. Fucking awesome. I guess even if it hadn't been a juke, I, I still would have eaten shit there, but no, maybe not, he would have been locked into it. Actually starting to kind of hate the game. The way that you're you're locked into into uh, into blocks, and then enemies will get hits on you and shit because like you you, you try to attack instead of counterattacking, and like the way that you're like locked in the blocks and and uh, and parries and everything, like it just sucks. To be fair, the drones have been a, a, a real fucking pain in the ass for the whole entire run on purity, so the drones are a huge difficulty spike on this. Oh, that was lucky. Okay. I hit guard, but I was stuck in the animation from before, so it wouldn't let me guard. Like shit like that. What the fuck was it? I was blocking? Was I even in the block stance? It went through that hard that that uh, it, it just uh, it just ate it. Damn, I didn't see that. Because of the wall. Why are you trying to pull enemies if it's too risky? I'm pretty good at uh, at getting the block of the parry off. But that's it's not that that bad. Is the block directional? I don't think so. No, I think you can block anything from any direction. Patched out. <gasps> oh, 
we didn't do photo mode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Uh oh. Is it because this guy died in here? I was gone four minutes. Why are you doing F11 again? Because the, the fucking combat encounter bugged and I'm trying to fix it. What if I leave and come back in? What the f- Maybe you can't do this wall. Alright. This looks promising. Do, 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 do. Not bad for an abandoned facility. All the arrays are online. Now we just have to activate them. Oh. We must have locked down the facility when they evacuated. Really? That's not going to stop us. Proceed to the observation deck to initiate alignment. Huh. You gotta hand it to Cree. She thought of everything. Oh, I thought there was gonna be like a little story sequence here. Where's the cutscene? Yeah, I was expecting one too. Oh, we didn't skip that much. See, you made it. Three's informed me you're in need of assistance, so here I am. It's a long trip. Couldn't have been easy. I might be 200 years old, but I'm as spry as a Padawan. Amazing. Oh, Cal, this is simply amazing. Can you start the arrays when we're in position? Oh, I stand ready for your order. It would be my honor to see Master Kree's dream alive once more. Your master. For a beer. Okay, honestly, confront bode. Tanalor. A line raise a Kobo social. Confront bode on Tanalor. Honestly, though, chat. Even with context, isn't this kind of fucking weird? Right. Time to head back to the Mantis, buddy. Let me go through the abyss. I'm not thrilled about it either. But it's the only way we're getting to Tantalor. I wonder if we can even get through that door. Uh oh. I guess we could kill ourselves on the elevator if we need to. Or in the pit. Yeah, we could do it in the pit. This is a long elevator. Holy shit. Oh, you can see the bottom now. That's nice. Oh, the door opened. Alright, that's good. Alright, fight time? No? Alright. I got soft locked on that elevator and it took them a full week to fix it. Skill issue. Skill issue. So, see how last time we were here, only these two were green. And now this one's green and this one's green. I was expecting that we'd have to make all of them green. Is this something else instead? Is this like, uh, like health upgrades or something? Or what is this shit? Anyway, let's go finish the game and then whatever time we have left, we'll, um, because what if, what if Boat is like actually super hard on purity? Uh, and then with whatever time is left, we'll run around and do side stuff, or we'll just, we'll just, you know, talk shit. Hello, I was wrong when I said Dark Souls 3 enemies had, had iframes. I'm sorry, I must have sounded like a real jerk. So true, so true, the biggest jerk ever. The biggest jerk of all chat yesterday. And that includes the guy that told the guy that he was prematurely born because he was criticizing Tears of the King. Nah, you were fine, dude, it's fine. You were just uh, probably thinking of something else instead. You don't need to apologize. Where to next, PD? Not the same without him in the background. Hope Grease is ready for a bumpy ride. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Are we ready for a bumpy ride? Oh, we have to go use the hollow thing. Yeah, my bad. Is it time? We're heading to the abyss now. Fire up the arrays. I'll be monitoring your progress from here. May the force be with you all. And you see. 
Oh yeah, remember him? At least we will die together. Together. Hey, great talk, kid. Hopefully they can fix that on my tombstone. Look. how this this compass coordinates thing helps at all. You still have to fly through this shit. Getting a tad cozy. It's not just you. Z, what's going on? The arrays are overloading. There's nothing I can do. What? I need to go faster. I'm going as fast as I can. Oh, maybe the array is like wait, wait a minute. clearing something. Are you crazy. If you jump in a hyperspace blind, they'll be picking up pieces of the man. It's all over the outer rim. Do you trust me? No. No, I do, Cal. God, I hate that line so much. Let her ride. Now. Alan? Alright, we did it. Star Wars is cursed. Did it, you three Holy shit. <laughs> well, at least none of us lost our cool. I think the worst wow. parts of this game are the Star Wars parts. It's worth it. And the non-Star Wars parts are, are really good. But when it goes like, oh, time to be Star Wars, it's, it's like, oh, uh, fucking this is shit. Behold the dark side power. Darth Poncho. Yeah, seriously, even with context, this is such a weird ending. It's like the first game all over again with the story just being like it's there. So this is Tanalor. Not what you were expecting. I don't know what I was expecting. So much has changed since I first heard his name. The temple's this way. 
Dagon and Centauri Cree plan their future here. And look where I've got them. Bode will not let this end peacefully. He has already used fatherhood to justify betrayal and murder. Now we have him cornered, with nowhere else to run. He will kill or be killed. Yeah, again, well, even with context. Say something! You're right. But what about Kata? She's not much younger than we were when our families were taken from us. I know. You and I will carry that loss for the rest of our lives. Kata still has a chance. Yes, she does. Very well. We will give Bo the choice to stand down. For Kata's sake. And ours. I keep thinking about something Seer once said. A warning. Every Jedi faces the dark side. I feel so much hatred towards Bode. Seer won her battle with the dark side. You will too. At least the game didn't just populate this area with a bunch of Jerry's. That's good. Hey, Kata. This is Marin. She's a friend. I'm sorry Papa hurt you. Yeah. He said I'd never see you again. What are you doing? So my read on this when we saw it last time was that these two had interacted a couple times before. Like, she says BD1 very warmly. Like, oh, I know BD1. We've hung out for, for days in between some of the side quest stuff. Instead, it's like fucking, like, one brief meeting. Here. Kata, your father stole something very important. We're gonna ask him to give it back. Will you show us the way? Okay. Follow me. I don't like it here. It's dark and lonely. You don't have to be afraid. How are you going to get food, Bode? Better? You're very pretty. I know. How did you get here? It wasn't easy. Oh, there really wasn't another line about how Cal should have been able to sense him with the Force. Oh, fucking hell. Or Seer. Or... You shouldn't have followed us. Endo... Stay back, Cordova, the whatever the fuck his name was. Like, She will be safe. I promise, Bode. But listen to me. It's over. Lay down your weapons. This planet will be a haven for those hunted by the Empire. Including Kata. And you. But you have to surrender. Now. Go outside, Kata. Listen to them, please! Enough! Your daughter, bud. 
I will decide what's best for my family. Oh no! Hit me. Wait, was that fucking like Marin's hit? What the f Distract him! I will strike from the shadows. It's over, Kestis! It looked like it fit! It fit! Oh yeah, th this doesn't make sense here either anymore. Embrace the dark side? What? Shit! Oh, no. oh, he's immune? He's immune? Why is he immune? Bone has iframe? He really does have iframes. Oh, okay, we got him. Wasn't a kick, but we got him. Don't put this on your daughter. Bode, I was trying for a kick, but it wouldn't let me run. Please listen to them, Papa. All right. And when the Empire comes, will you be able to protect my little girl? I'm sorry, Kala. I tried. Oh, Bode, you're dumb. Thanks for the gun, Bode. Yoshi. Yoshi. Good boy. Man, a cop. How are you feeling? 
better. Thanks. Good. We should speak. I was not much older than you when I lost my family. For many years, I carried this pain. I did not want to feel better. Why? I thought if I let go of the pain... Shouldn't his forced ghost be like in the I background right now, just like shaking his I head? Loved. But I was wrong. And one day... I met someone who also lost his family. Oh, the temptation. Together we found another way to survive. This pain is yours. It is part of you. When my mother died, it changed Papa. And me too, I guess. Yes. But it does not have to define you. And you must not let it consume you. Okay, Marin, calm the fuck down. Is that what I said last time too? The hell, Marin? This does not bode well. So what do you think? Is the next game going to be like a big time skip and, and Kata is going to be like grown up Jedi training or, or what? That would be like what? A, uh, how old's Kata do we think? Eight? So grown up Kata training would be like 10 years from now? Like is that after the trilogy? How, how long before the trilogy is this? It would be right before A New Hope, wouldn't it? Could be a little sooner than that. How many years was between this game and the last one? Because it might be the same amount as, as uh, again. Five? So five more years? Okay. How old is Luke Skywalker right now? Ten? Okay. Doing a story concurrently with the, with the events of A New Hope would be interesting, I think. Maybe they'll go that route. And by interesting, I mean it would be dog shit. But, like, you know, it'd be interesting to, like, someone who would want to make one of these games. From a marketing perspective. Oh, they could call it A Different Hope. A new toke, dude. Why is it time soon? Yeah, it's really weird. This game has some very strange decisions. You saved my life on Brock. You let me walk my own path when I needed to. You 
taught me what it truly means to be a Jedi. Now you're gone. We will continue your legacy, Seer. What what does he have on the the strap? We will build something that can outlast the Empire. I promise you that. I promise. Blaster energy batteries? What are those? But I'm scared. I almost lost myself. We <laughs> don't know if I'm ready. <laughs> Emergency weed. <laughs> I don't know if I'm ready for what Cal, I'm you're about to turn to the dark side. Quick, smoke this and calm down. Aw, oh, dude, thanks. That was close, bro. I know. Nah, I'm super chill. All right. Would that work? Not only would it work, it did work. That's how in uh, in in the last movie they uh, they re they redeem um, Vader, right? Luke rolls him a big fat doobie and uh, and puts it into his ventilation Guard mask thing, and he just calms down. Is doobie the right terminology? Count Doobie. <laughs> Count <D> Doobie. Hmm, <laughs> much to learn. <laughs> I can't do a Yoda. <sighs> Star Wars Objective Survivor. All right. Sorry, Stig. All right, so with context, this was not that great. Uh, the story, not great. Uh, I would like to do the Ravis fight. So we skipped the Ravis fight, and we skipped the the third fight with um, with Dagon. Uh, wasn't really a big fan of the first two fights with Dagon. Maybe the third one's better. I, if I played the game again, which I probably will at some point, I would like to do the Ravis fight legit and see if it's much better. The boat fight was pretty bad when we didn't have purity on, uh, but, but that was because it was just like kind of sloppy. Which kind of like sums up both of the games, really. That they're just, they I feel like these would be absolutely fantastic games in terms of gameplay and like like combat and exploration, and like progression systems too. If they just had maybe another six months or a year to just clean up all this all all the shit that that is in like the animations and um, how how just bad it feels to like chain moves together and everything but i will qualify that with maybe that's because i'm a jedi, a jedi master the stories for both of them just seem like a, a complete waste i don't know i don't know how anyone could think any differently so apparently i think this is objective um i don't know the stories in these are are, are pretty pretty bad this is still probably my favorite recent star wars media um i think my favorite period is kotor 2 and then after that I don't know, man. Like, I don't really like the movies all that much. Maybe Jedi Academy? Then maybe these? I don't know. But, yeah. Well, not exactly what we expected. You should watch Andor. I heard that Andor really home. needed a, needed an editor, yeah, though, and doesn't understand colonialism. Yeah, I guess it is. Still got a lot of work ahead of us. All right. It will take time to contact the hidden path. And find the anchorites. And build a saloon. I mean, the place is creepy, but it does have franchise potential. It does, it's true. This belongs with you. It belongs with all of us. Yeah. What do you think, kid? Should we give it a shot? Yeah. Let's do it. Ah, oh, that's the spirit. Oh, that's great. Come on. I'll bet you're hungry. I'll make you something to eat. Did you ever have a scar stick? Lots of salt.
But yeah, anyway, I really like these games, but I, I wish that they had just a little bit more time for um, for getting some of this stuff right. However, I think that a lot of the problems I have with the combat and how moves feel to chain together um, might be harder to fix than I initially think, because why wouldn't they have fixed them between games then? Like, I don't know. Maybe it's just Jedi Master, because I've never played these games on anything other than Jedi Master. So maybe that is, that's, that's the reason. Or maybe. All right, let's pick where we go next. All right, it's time, chat. It's time. Route to the shattered moon. Because they don't see them as issues, maybe. But I feel like I, hope that I keep saying feel like. Um, oh, look at you. They must no have played like Sekiro and and uh, a lot of the other Souls games time, as a as a how reference for this, right? Kid? So, Fine. how do they not Thanks. play those games and then play this game and just immediately feel, oh shit, chaining parries is ass? So maybe it is um maybe it is Jedi Master. Or maybe it's like when you develop something you you just know how it feels and what they're going for. All right, make like a rock and quit moving around my cabin. Very good that you're qualifying it, clarifying its objective. I know, right? That's always my uh my intent. What did you think of the Rick boss fight, Joe? We we skipped Rick. We left him alive. Cal, don't show up out of nowhere like that. You'll scare the salt out of me. I turned myself into a door technician, Morty. I wonder if uh, if I go back, if he'll still be there. I played both games on differing difficulties. You'll you will see an insane difference in combat. It's much more enjoyable and lower because enemies are less tankier and do less damage. It's the major issue in these two games, IMO, because they raise the difficulty artificially. Yeah, maybe that's that's the problem. I think that incoming damage on Cal on Jedi Master is fine without purity on. I think it's I think it's okay. But enemies are a bit tanky with purity off. Mash? Who the fuck's Mash? Are you Mash? What was that? Force glitter? What the fuck was that? I was ready to parry and I was like, okay, doesn't have a melee weapon, so this is gonna be a dodge. It's gonna be a charged blaster shot instead. And then instead it was force fucking prismatic shards. What the fuck? Hell's that? Ready to fight, huh? Oh, you're not even Mash! What the fuck did you do? Hey, Mash. Watch this. Oh, okay. We just got mashed. Mash Cal Potatoes. Here it comes. Ah. Do you think purity worked as a concept? Yeah, I think it worked. I, I, it's definitely far from flawless, but I think it worked, yeah. Oh, shit. Another bounty pug. We should show this to Cage. Is Cyberpunk still the game that you broke the most? No, I think this is the game I broke the most. I think I broke this more than Cyberpunk. I think Cyberpunk is more baseline broken, like you'll see more glitches without going out of your way to find them than this. This game is pretty broken, but it's not that broken. But um, I, I broke this a lot more than I broke Cyberpunk. Although maybe not. Skipping so much of the story and seeing the dev messages and uh, for the for that that cutscene that wasn't even in the game after all um, find out what this was a holds. moment. Ah. 
Over. Forgot to heal. Was I not full health? I thought I was full health. I thought I was keeping myself topped up. If so, I, I guess I really did forget to heal. Oh shit. Oh, fucking... I can't. It's really hard to get timing for healing when you're getting pelted by lasers. Okay, still incredibly difficult. Oh man, I need to save my uh, my blaster shots until the the shooter droids come down. But it's really hard to tell which one are the which ones are the shooty ones. Did you did two charge blasts accidentally? Oh, when you when you do a parry with with the uh, with the blaster, it uses charge shot ammo. Oh, what the. <sighs> Need to remember to do force pushes toward the end. Use dual bladed lightsaber, it's easier for the for the parries. Oh why don't I just turn the difficulty down to Padawan while I'm at it? Why would force push trigger it? Didn't do it. That one was deserted. Absolutely fucking wasn't. Are you insane? Toss me one, BD. Oh my god. Here we go. 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 Shit. <sighs> Hello less Hello. Nest or Lordran? Um, I prefer Hollow Knight to Dark Souls, I think. So I'll pick Hollow Nest. Hello, Hello, Nest. Oh, Ow, did they come down so fast? Where the fuck did they come from? I thought they were. Oh man, I must have just lost track of time. Holy shit. That wasn't it. Joe, do you watch Succession? I have not seen a single episode of Succession. I heard it's good though. I'm opening fire. Okay, so I have to kill, I have to clear one. I have to clear one right away, and then I need to use that in order to survive. Is the explosion bigger than the visual radius? Is this like a challenge or something? They're kind of like the, uh, the, um, oh my god, I can't remember what it's called. The, the Doom portals in Doom Eternal. There's optional funnels challenges. Usually you get like a skill point for them. I'm guessing if you don't have purity on, this is fucking easy as hell. Why were none of those fucking parries for deflections on the bolts there? Was I out of stamina? Did you stream Returnal? I did not stream Returnal, no. I'd like to though, I think we'll stream that at some point. I hear it's good. No, not that move. Not that move, not that move. Saturday stream? Uh, I don't know. Isn't Returnal kind of short? I think we would just do uh, just do it in, in the week. Fucking hell, man. What the fuck killed me? What's the current max? This one. What the fuck killed me? I didn't even see the that blaster. 
What the? Yeah, I can't. I don't think I can do force push anymore once. Uh, once there's more than two groups of blaster guys down, but I feel like I'm gonna have to risk it at some point. That didn't do it. I don't understand how I got hit there from the canister. I've, I've been doing the force push against the canister the whole time, and they never did it. Mm. You did this before. You can do it. Again. I've never done this one, Chad. What are we talking about? This is the opposite of motivation. Help me. I love how he, he decided to shoot one that was off camera instead of the blaster droid that I was fucking pointing at. I, I just love Cal so much. I love Cal so much. Bomb just floating in the fucking air. Little we'll help, PD. Point acquired. Did you actually finish the game twice but didn't see Cal using Dark Side once? Yep, that's true. That's what happened. What's the worst part of the game? Worst part of the game is probably the story. Worst part of the of the gameplay is how uh, you get locked into animation states and you are constantly wrestling against what the game uh, thinks you should be doing compared to what you're trying to do. Okay, let's go back to Kobo. Is there anything anyone would like me to go and see that they've they've played Where the game themselves and they know there's something cool that we can go see or anything like that or, or what? We're Kobo bound. God, you're gonna love Kobo. What's it like? Oh, lots of waterfalls. <laughs> Everything grows there. It's great. And, oh yeah, yeah. How could I forget Pyloon Saloon? I'm the owner and proprietor. <laughs> Is there music? Yes. And they love to take requests. Okay. I hope they have Trandoshan Funk. That's my favorite. Nerd! Do Turgle's Romance route? Aw, oh, do you get a TJ? Oh man. Someone said the the Bounty Hunter quest is good. What's the, what's the Bounty Hunter quest? How do we do that? Isn't that just walk around and kill the Bounty Hunters that attack you? Or do you have to go and talk to her and she says, Hey, go here, do this. <gasps> Another way. Always an angle. Always. Lost a family. Looking for a new one. Um. I can relate, Cal. But you gotta make a choice. The future or the past. Can't have it all. <laughs> Not in this galaxy. Yeah. Yeah, that could work. 
Uh, Alright, so you can force hear echoes of Bode practicing how he's going to betray you, which apparently he did here next to Turgle, who idle NPC gurgles here. And yet, we didn't see any of them before? Nothing? What am I doing? I thought to talk to Turgle. Cal, I gotta confess something. Uh-oh. Here we go. That tech I tried to sell to Ravis, there's more of it in the valley. A building right in the center. You can't miss it. We've already been there, Turgle, but thanks for the tip. Really? Well, is it too late to say that we split whatever you find 50-50-50? Maybe next time. I'm gonna hold you to that. 50-50-50? There he is. Got your first target lined up. Looks like some Hexian hack named Kip Oster has been slinking around Dredger Gorge. This guy likes to catch his prey off guard, so watch your back. Bunger? Thanks for the tip. Bunger, 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 bunger. Alright, so we have the quest for it now. How do I how do I get the quests on the screen? Played this game twice, by the way. Uh bounties. Oh man. We're going after Kip Ostar. Show on Hollow Map. Alright, he's over here. Alright, let's go. You can talk to her multiple times to pick up more than one bounty at a time. Less bat tracking. Oh, can you? That's what I tried to do. And instead it talked about us killing uh, Danganronpa. Hold on, let's go back. Are you going to get all of them? Do I look like a streamer with a plan? It doesn't always work. Okay. Why is the breed looking... Get on, sir. Brought a couple of... Oh. What can I insist? it? Fine. All right, we have two this time. All right, rumor. It's, it was here, right? This looks familiar. All right, so we're going... Oh, man. Where are we? Here. So we're turning to our right, and we're going over there. So turn to our right, and we're going here. Maybe we should use a, a fast travel point. What do you think? What do you think is the worst trend in video games at the moment? Or recent trend in video games? That's a really hard question. I don't know. Uh, games of service. A lot of monetization. Uh, releasing games when they're not finished. Um... I feel like that's not really the answer you're looking for, though. You're 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 looking more for like a gameplay kind of thing. What's a, what's a gameplay kind of convention that I don't like? Everything kind of being open world. Most a lot of games, especially the higher the budget they are, trying to trying to like be more than one thing instead of uh, doing a couple things really well. All right, so he's he's up there. No, he's in here. I'm blind now. Oh, here he is. Oh, sh! Do you think the bonfire system is overused now? It feels like most games just want to copy something. So, copy souls like without trying something different? Yeah, it's probably overused. Okay, what, what, what is that? I want to see what that is. Why is there, why, why is that here? Who's here? Oh, shit. I legit just tried to pull out the uh, the pure plate to, to mark that. All right, you're dead. Easy peasy. That's one less tail to worry about. Easy peasy. All right, and I'm guessing the other one is on Coruscant. If the other one's on Coruscant, we're not doing it. I'm, I'm not I'm not planet hopping to finish this quest. Or will I? Is it here? Rumor here? Well, oh, you know what? We should go to Coruscant because we should see what's in that door that rattles now that we can open it. The, like, legit open it instead of, like, F11 our way through it. You'll have to plan it hop a lot for bounties. Is it really worth it just to see fucking Boba Fett show up that we can't kill? Really? Oh my god, this is how Boba Fett got this scorch mark on his armor. It's because of when he fought Cal. Alright, that's great. Hmm. I should have got another one. I should have got another bounty, huh? I should have got another bounty. I'd like to get off, please. I'd like to get off. I'd, like, I'd like to get off. Sheer Shore could bring out the best of people. She told me oh. so much. What? Oh. Just bring in the kid bounty hunting. Alright. Just bring in the kid bounty hunting. 
All right, so where is this bounty and where is the door that we couldn't open? This is not a shrine. Remember your training. Which training? This crew is led by a Jedi. You must be in top form. This isn't the first time the ISB has tried to infiltrate Saw Gerrera's organization. I was always your best asset during the Clone Wars, and you know it. The whole time. The whole time. I thought there was a meditation spot out here. Or does one just appear when you want to fast travel back? Yay. Yeah, that's a good point. Why wasn't the echo here before? No, 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 no. It's fucking touchdown. Is all the harassment about the Witcher videos tarnished your feelings on the series? I wouldn't classify it as harassment. Um, no, it hasn't. Whoa. Hey Joe, I want to know if how much have you played Hidden Space Outlaw on your own after you finished on streams, considering how much you love the game. I didn't play it again after the after the stream, so I still have it installed. I haven't gotten back to it yet. I don't have very much time to, to play games on my own. Um, like the only reason I have any time to play uh, Star Rail is because I played on the computer upstairs while I'm interacting with the with the family. I just have it on the background. I put on auto. It doesn't really demand a lot of my attention, and also let the kids do the pulls with me, that sort of thing. What the fuck? So stuff like that. I don't think going upstairs and and uh, and playing Hypnospace Outlaw while I'm while I'm talking to the kids is uh or having one of them on my lap is the uh, the best uh, way to play that game. Open the door. Open the door. What are you doing, Carol? Why the? F all right, I'm gonna have to kill them all. Is Star Rail better or worse than Genshin? Uh, in terms of like what little I've gleaned of the story and the writing, it is far superior to Genshin. Probably in terms of w world building as well. In terms of gameplay, absolutely fucking not. Um, I don't know if this is true or not, but my my uh, feeling of it so far is that it's more free to play friendly though. So in that respect, for the gameplay, it might be better. But who knows? Oh, he wasn't done attacking. All right, my bad. You wouldn't know you aren't free to play. I have a free to play account on Genshin. I played it a lot. I mean, I haven't played it in like fucking like 18 months or whatever, but like I, when I was playing, I played a lot on free to play. Right here, BD. Fuck, I'm so impatient. Content might get harder. Yeah, if the content does get harder, then it's gonna get less free to play friendly because there's there's no or there's little way to outskill turn based stat based RPG. Whereas whereas Genshin is very stat based, don't get me wrong, and very gear based. Um, a lot of it comes down to how well you can play. All right, maybe we're done the stream chat. Clearly, I'm not. I'm tired. Clearly, um, you can uh, play better in Genshin, where you can't really like do that much better in the turn-based uh, space. A little better, sure. Ah, Looks like someone just volunteered to get him. timed out. Oh, is someone being bad? Uh-oh. Someone's in trouble. All right, we did it, world first. Okay, so... Where is the door? Where's the enemy? Okay, the enemy's there. All right, let's go here and see. How would you rank these streams on the tier list? I mean, if you like me on my bullshit, it's cream. Let's keep moving, buddy. Probably great vegetables. Oh. Hollow puck. Let's get this to cage. I watched an abridge, abridged version of your Zero Escape streams. I have to say, man, they're cream. Yeah, those are cream streams for sure. Yeah, some of the best streams we've done. They were really fun. Are you going to stream react to summer game showcases? No, I don't think so. 
All right, here we go. How's it going, buddy? The hell's that? Frenzy Judge. Just a new enemy this late? What? What the fuck is a Frenzy Jotas? Okay, so back to Kobo. I think I don't think we're gonna be. I don't think we have time to finish this quest chat. Let's go see. If most of them are on Kobo and we can double up on some of them, maybe it's fine. Kobo? How's everyone doing in Evolve Idol? I think I'm at thirty percent mastery now. You said that Seer gave you the money to open your saloon, yes? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's right. She did. I was short a few credits. Started some small talk. Ah, I didn't even need to ask. She always just knew what I needed. I don't know how. Do you know where she found the credits? No. Nah, she never told me. And I never asked. Maybe she just Jedi mind tricked you into using your own credits, Grease. I still can't, fi can't find it. Just Google Evolve Incremental and it'll be the first result, I think. Did my first BioC yesterday playing as Salamanders on a, on a volcanic planet. Now that sounds pretty comfy. First BioC is fun. I like how space goes. It gets slow toward the end, but before that, it's like, ooh, this is interesting. I haven't gone past it yet, so I have no idea what the other ones are like. Uh, this will be the rest of the stream, probably, um, everyone. So if you're not interested in this, you can you can go. <laughs> uh, I can answer questions if anyone wants to. If anyone wants to ask anything. Uh, also, this is the the last stream this week. We're we're done for a bit while I finish up getting all the streams on YouTube. I don't know how they're gonna go up though. I don't know if I want to just release them all in one big batch or as many batches as I can. Heads up, killer. Sork Falmos just doubled your bounty and one of the brood's top killers has come to collect. All right, so we have find Kili Oso. All right, someone said leave and then come back. Isn't it risky uploading them all at once due to YouTube's bullshit? Um, well, I don't think I would publish them all at once unless they were clear. I guess it depends on how it's how it goes with uh piss. I guess how it goes with uh with the claims. Listen up, Cal. Okay, can I get more than two if I just go out and go back in? Favorite Hollow Knight OST song. Dung Defender, obviously. I can make the whole house erupt into chaos if I just say, hey, what does Dung Defender say again? And both boys will start banging on their chests like Donkey Kong and go do 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 Oh, we got three. Well, oh, damn. Make yourself at home. Let's just keep going. Any kind of question? If so, thoughts on Black Myth Wukong? I don't know what that is. Your kids sound based. They're pretty based. They're based on me. Okay. Can we just get them all? This is a weird system. What's your favorite boss in any video game ever? Oh, that's a really hard question. I don't know if I can answer that. In terms of like build up and co concept, I really like Lavos in uh, Chrono Trigger because that's my favorite game. Uh, favorite boss for gameplay? I don't know, man. Pure Vessel's probably up there. Favorite Souls fight is probably something in Sekiro. You, hey, Cal. Good to see you. Probably one of the raids in in World of Warcraft has a, has a fight that I would be like, oh damn, that's such a good fight. But that's like a communal thing. If I hadn't done it like, like legitimately like a hundred times, I would say Lich King, but it gets old. Explaining that to new people How'd every you week. Get involved with Sork Tormo and the Haxian. Uh, uh, so all right, that seems like all we can get right now. Come on in, grab a spot at the bar. Did you beat the hardest Pantheon in Hollow Knight? Yeah, I couldn't do it with all bindings though. I can only do it with one binding at a time. I could probably do it with two or three, but all four, I don't think I have it in me. The collector is just too fucking hard with all bindings. Were you a guildmaster or officer in your WoW days? What class did you play? I was an officer for a little bit in a in a US top 50 guild. Um, before and after that, I I ran my own guild. So the guild uh, fell apart at one point and I just fucked off into like a, a higher rating tier guild. And I was there for like, I don't know, half a year. And uh, then, you know, shit happened. And then when I went back to the game next expansion, I revived the guild as a 10 men thing. Right, where where are these uh there is he one gotta be there right 
Sorry for asking this question, but after the music discussion, the tainted to your chances of playing Hi-Fi Rush, are you still open to play other rhythm games? They're probably my favorite genre of games, and it makes me sad you're upset because of what happened. I'm not upset, I just don't want to have the fucking conversation over and 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 over again in chat. So I don't want to be upset, I guess. But yeah, I don't want to stream them. I'll play them, but I don't want to stream them. Wait, what? Hi-Fi Rush is cancelled? Hi-Fi Rush is super fucking cancelled. Super fucking cancelled. I'm unaware of this conversation. Oh, nice bait. I'm not falling for it. Wait, what? Shit. Uh, we go this way? Oh, man. Did I take the wrong meditation point? The conversation was, why aren't you clapping on beat when the, the dryer goes off in the room? I said, how do you tell where the beat is? And then chat said, you tell because it's obvious, blah, 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 blah. And this led to the distinction of whether the beat of a song is subjective or objective. And I didn't say that it was subjective. I proposed the idea that it might be subjective. And chat said, no, it's objective. And I said, okay, can someone tell me how? And no one could. And that's it. I'm not saying it's subjective, I'm not saying it's not objective, I'm just saying I feel like someone should be able to explain it to me how. And then people say, you, how you expect us to explain like, like, like fucking, like, centuries of music theory to you in a Twitch chat? And to that I say, well, it seems like almost everyone here understands it and I don't, so I feel like it should be fairly simple and straightforward to explain it to me, and then no one, no one can. Like, a bunch of people, like, some people who are musicians still can explain it to me on jazz after the fact in a, in a more focused setting. And their examples were super fucking weak. So, again, I don't, I don't get it. I'm not saying that it's subjective. I'm just saying I don't under I understand how it is objective. I wish I did. And I don't want to have that conversation again every single time we play a rhythm game on stream. So, fuck it. I think that it's prob probably intersubjective or it's a standard and people are getting it mixed up. This is a very common thing when our when our when an artistic uh, thingamajig becomes so commonplace and so well accepted that people start to think that it's objective. It's not. It's just that we're just so used to it that we think it's objective, and it's but it's not. That's what I think is happening there, but I'm not sure. Alright, he's dead. Cage will want to see this. Okay, where are we going? Wait, was there a red thing in there? How do we open that? Is there a, an electric light thing? There was a whole stream section where he and chat went over the circuit board blueprints to cut the speaker connection. What? <laughs> Thanks for the explanation. The discussion itself isn't really that frustrating. It's just that people people don't listen <laughs> in the same way that uh in this and i don't mean that oh they think i'm wrong that means they're not listening that's not what i mean whatsoever P people are probably not gonna listen right now um in the same way that the other week when i said hey i had a dream and then i told the story and then people and then chat lit up with fake story what the fuck fake 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 and i'm like yeah it's fake i know it's fake i said it was fake at the beginning i said it was a fucking dream in the same way during that conversation people were like why can't you just admit that you might be wrong why can't you just admit you could be right like, like just over and over and over and over and over again and i've been saying that the whole entire conversation the whole fucking conversation i've been saying i don't think i'm right i just don't understand it can you please help me understand so that's the thing i don't want to expose myself to again it's really fucking annoying. Is it here? V visco, vi vis viscid bog. No, that's just an area. Is that one of them? Have you not considered just, you know, looking it up? Sorry to trigger you, but when I looked it up, everything I found seemed to support my case. So I didn't want to go with that because I thought maybe I was just like subconsciously finding like shit I wanted to read and, and to reinforce my point. So I didn't really want to go off of that. But yeah, I did look it up. I know how easy it is to fall for that sort of thing. So I, I try not to, to, to go off of it. I had a really, really serious argument with uh, someone on Jad's once. And by serious, I mean like it got, it wasn't a fun argument. Like this, this was, this was like, he was being a real fucking prick about it too. And he linked some like super, super fucking dense like like biology article that was just so hard to read and was like here read this or the conversation can't continue and i was like i, I like wh what the fuck are you fucking talking about you know and the conclusion was self-evident and i and i was like okay so then after going back and forth i was like fuck it okay i'll read it and it and it supported my argument instead of his and he didn't even realize it so it's really easy to um to 
think that something is on your side when it's not, you know? Like, and then when I said, you know, when I told him that, he was like, no, you. <laughs> oh, we're dead. Read this article I didn't read, then we'll talk. It was probably just say, hey, I did I did a couple of Googles, a quick Google search for it, and this was the first hit that I, that I saw that looked the most official. I skimmed the opening paragraph. It seems to support my point. Here, read this before this continues. This here's my appeal to authority. And then just actually know if you read it a little further. Someone else want a turn. I'm hit. I'll catch them all. Help BD. All right, we did it. Oh, we didn't do it. Man, what was that attack uh, series there? What was that discussion even about? Uh, I'd rather not say it was kind of a yikes topic. Kind of in the vein of elf racism. Um, where is the quest? Where was it? The bounty hunter thing? There it is. Fuck, I'm bad. Alright. Oh, we got quite a few of them. Alright, where's Selfin... Selfin Juke? Ooh, Kilo... Kilioso. Okay, that's he... Excuse me, that's here, isn't it? Or, oh, that's Jetta. Fuck, I don't want to go to Jetta. Alright, let's see if we can get more that, that are on Jetta before we go to Jetta. Oh, it's on Jetta. Alright, what, what about the other one? This is on Kobo. So that's in the observatory. Alright. Alright, what do we think? Which one's closest? Probably this one. Let's get ah. Look at this. Beanie, stim here. Get up here. Ah. Stim, no. Oh, did that hurt? I'm hit. Can't take a hit. Some help. That hit the spot. All right, so let's go back to another hunter off bug back. snacks, and let's see if uh, there's any more on Kobo or any more we can get for Jetta before we can um, before we leave. Get through this quite quickly, actually. Do you think the devs for these games at Desert Planet is just in case they feel the urge later in development to add a bunch to add, sorry to add in a I hate sand line? I hope so. He said it! Cal said I hate sand! I clapped when he said it! Surprised they didn't. Has there been any other Star Wars media that said that line? They kind of said something hey, close Cal, to it. To see Seen a lot of hunters in my How many been? Not a chance. How long you... Long Alright, that's it. Alright, let's, let's leave and go back in and see if uh, we'll get another one, just in case. What video game do you think was the biggest waste of potential? Uh, the Last of Us Part 2. Um, maybe release No Man's Sky? I feel like there's been a game or two on stream that I've been like, this is heartbreaking, if only X, if only Y. No Man's Sky is apparently pretty good now. Now that you've proven yourself a proper hunter. Dang. Okay, so let's go Welcome to Jetta. Why do you clap to the dryer in the first place? Is the drink copyrighted? I think it's fun. Despite not being a very musical person, or, or very musically inclined, rather, um, I do like to sing a lot. I'm not very good at it, but I really like singing. If I ever get, like, uh, the house to myself, which never happens, actually. So if everyone's asleep and I'm in the basement and I'm listening to music, usually I'll sing along fairly loudly, actually. I love singing. Jetta, it is. Favorite Crush 40 song? I don't know. I didn't Crush know Leo Cordova that well, but I'll miss him all the same. He seemed like a nice guy. Favorite very wise. spaceship in video games. Kindness, most of all. I feel bad for BD. All that time apart... I don't know. The droid will be fine. He is as resilient as Cal. The Kotor one, maybe? I don't know. That's a I I can't even think of them. Maybe the Normandy? I don't know. Huh. The stranger from Outer Wild. Oh well does that count? I, yeah, I guess it does count. Yeah, probably that one then. If that counts then yeah for sure. For some reason I was thinking that's more of a space station, but it's not, is it? It is it is a ship. Yeah. Have you played Deep Rock Galactic? I have not, no. Would I like it? I don't think I would, but maybe, maybe I'm wrong. Okay, where is, where are these bounties? What's that? Is that a bounty? Over here? Oh, there's a whole area we didn't go to over there. 
was kind of expecting to get a triple jump. Oh, this is the, the map that's not filled in. Okay. So we want to fast travel to here. Oh, Bode. I'll give him a I gun. I believe how blind I've been. I know how to turn him. It's so obvious. I'll just give him a gun. The bastard's in love. What do you mean, turn me? What? <gasps> Vader rematch? If you're doing this, you do it now. No hesitation. This is a secure channel. How did you... Listen to me. I'm an Imperial agent who has located a terrorist cell on Jeddah. Don't trust your scanners. Just follow this locator beacon's coordinates. There are multiple Jedi at this location. Inform the Inquisitorius at once. If Lord Vader wants Seer Junda, he better hurry. Well, and they just listened? And then the Jerry just ran into the room and said, Vader, Vader, here we go. Focus. Oh man, Mila is upset. Two Vaders. I'm with you. <laughs> Darth Vader's. You left the kid with Grease? What if we need her for something around here? Even though it got excluded during the during the wheel streams, would you consider doing a Katamari stream at some point, even even if not in the near future? Yeah, sure. I guess so. I'd, I'd like to, to check that out. I just don't think it's going to be a very easy. good time. I don't think I'm going to like the game. Maybe I will. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, man. We got this super early last time, too, didn't we? Oh, no. Wait, is this even one of them, or is there something else here? I feel like I would have seen the uh, the bounty hunter by now. Are you excited for the new David Cage game, which is also a Star Wars game? I'm super fucking excited for that. You have no idea. Oh, he's down here. He's not up here. Okay. Ready yourself for I have no here. Help! Oh, you're in trouble. Whoa! Toss me one, BD. Here, buddy. Oh, shit! Okay. They get a stim, BD. Phew. I needed that. And where's the other one? Over there? No. There's no way it's over there. Oh, that looks like I have to look for him. I don't want to look for him. Did you ever play Horizon Zero Dawn? I played it for a couple hours right before I got my Switch. And then I just played Breath of the Wild instead. Uh, because I thought that would make the, the better video. And that's what I wanted to do. I was gonna play. I was gonna make a video on one of those two games. And and if I didn't get a switch, I was gonna get. Uh, I was gonna do a video on Horizon Zero Dawn. Uh, I liked what I played of it. I'd like to get back to it, but I just never did. Maybe it's better than Breath of the Wild. I have no idea. I doubt it, but I'm sure it's pretty good. Have you played Tears of the Kingdom off stream? Yeah, I played it a little bit last night. Um, I really like the OLED switch. Wait, why can't I? Why can't I? What? Oh, is this cutting off fast travel to those areas? That's kind of weird. I really like the this switch compared to the other switch. It's pretty comfy Keep to hold. Going. Screen's pretty good on it. Do you still use the Steam Deck? Not as much as I thought I was going to, but... Oh, so this turned this into kind of like a side quest thing. Oh, I thought the jetpack was going to malfunction and send him flying, but it didn't. Okay. How's your Factorio bo base? I haven't played Factorio again since, uh, since I sh showed it on stream. Neat. Did you know the gun has its own parry that, that works on red moves? I knew it had its own parry. We've done it a couple times. I didn't know it worked on red moves. That's interesting. For a while, my Steam Deck was just a vampire survivor's machine. And it was a good one at that. <laughs> Fucking love iframes. I love iframes. I hate them. What? Why are you tanky as fuck? Purity malfunction? Them, buddy. That feels better. 
I wonder how much of a pain in the, pain in the ass it would be to set up mods for Stardew on the, the Steam Deck. And then I could play Stardew Valley Expanded on there. Okay, ser seriously, did, did Purity just turn off? Help, please. Why are these guys, like, tougher than Bode? Proceeds not to check. Cause I was, cause it was um, a rhetorical question. I know it's not turned off. Wait, how do I parry that? What? Later, the suckers. All right, I'm. I think I'm. I'm about to throw in the towel. The whole point of purity is that I kill in one hit. I also die in one hit, or one or two. If I have to fight these guys like a, they're a normal fight, but I still die in one or two hits, then I'm out. Sorry. So here I am. All right, one more try, and then I'm moving on, moving on, moving on, moving on. Sorry to ask this fighting game question. I forgive you, but you mentioned last stream about motion input as a skill check, but what what are your thoughts on modern input making the special moves a separate button, usually with a downside such as less damage or limiting your amount of moves compared to a classic input? Is this like the special move is just you hit a button and you do it, but it leaves you open to some, something? I think that could be an interesting way of playing those games. I don't know if it would be any better, but that's kind of like how Smash Brothers works, isn't it? It's just like, uh, it's a lot easier to pull the moves off. And I like Smash Brothers. Wish it was a fighting game. Lamayo got him. Behold my power. Okay. Who'd you main in Smash? Captain Falcon. It was definitely a br Brumman, yeah. Definitely a Brumman. All right, let's call it. Back to the ship. Hardest part of the game, yeah, definitely on purity for sure. And how many plasmids should you do your fir do the first couple of mad resets? Um, I can't remember because when you do it with four stars, uh, with challenge you get more. I think usually when I when I do a four star run, I, I end so up resetting next, with about 150, to... 160. I think without it, around 120, yeah, around 120. Make sure you get bunk beds, and uh, you'll get a lot more from your from your um, military population. Oh, I've been meaning to check up on Mom. Kata, you're picking dinner tonight. Whatever you want. Really? Really. What's your favorite food? Mmm, my Gito casserole. Uh, ugh, I can't make that. Blue puff cubes. I. Okay, you know what? We're having the usual. Greasy grease loaf. If I don't like it, can we make something else? Sure, but I bet the man is here gonna love it. Merritt, you heard him, right? Oh, yes. Would you think the game would be that would grow the channel audience the most fastest? Witcher 3? YouTube channel ain't going through any growth until, until that debt's paid. Have we done the Zelda poll already? Are we gonna play it more? The streamer decided that we're not gonna do it. The streamer finally made a decision. Rare, I know. Have to move if I want to call an echo. They call an echo from here. Mm. 
Oh man, he's really on. All right, he is really on. All right, we so we're, we're going to we're going to the moon. Heading to the shattered. And then one, two, three. Now. Yeah. All right. Do 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 do. All right. See you later, Star Wars Survivor. You're pretty good. I really enjoyed my time with this game. Anyway, uh, so I'll be gone for... Um, I don't know how long I'll be gone for. I'll be gone for the rest of the week, for sure. Um, if I'm going to be back next week, then I will let you know. Uh, it's possible it might be later on the week. It might not be on a Tuesday, but we'll see. Um, if I'm up late again and I can't sleep, then maybe I'll just like do an impromptu stream and we'll hang out and do something. I don't know if we're gonna play any more Zelda if we do if we do that, but hey, maybe I don't know. We can we could stream it non-linearly, but we'll see. But yeah, but that's it. Hope you enjoyed the stream series with Jedi Survivor. Went on a bit too long for some people, I know, but uh, I wanted to see the game through. Now that we did, I kind of feel like it wasn't worth it. We should have just we should just like st stuck a fork in it, but. Like, I didn't know how much we had actually skipped and everything, so it was good to, to make sure that we that we saw it all. But yeah, anyway, some fun moments, and that's Jedi Survivor. I quite liked it, actually. Surprisingly so. I really enjoyed it. Not just for the breaking, I enjoyed the game, like, uh, on its own terms as well, quite a bit. Anyway, so enjoy the rest of your week. I will see you when I see you. Hopefully it's next week. Um, and we'll be back with, I don't know if we're going to come back immediately into Gravity Rush 2, if we're going to play something else first, but I think next on the docket is supposed to be Gravity Rush 2 and then Metal Gear Solid, right? Let me just check on Discord real quick. Gravity Rush 2, Metal Gear Solid 1 through 5, Rabi Ribby, oh my god, Dujana, which I'm super nervous about playing, and then Al Siminium Files Nirvana. Oh, that's, that's pretty soon. Oh, damn, because uh, Dujana is pretty short. I think Dujana is a one-stream game. Rabbi Ribby is not that long, is it not? Gravity Rush 2 is not that long. Metal Gear Solid is going to take a while. Metal Gear Solid is going to take a couple weeks, maybe even a month. Um, so then we have uh, Somnium Files Nirvana. And then Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door, that's going to be hell to set up. Valhalla, interested to play that one. Crypt of the Necrodancer, take that off the list. That's a rhythm game. Nah, we'll play it. <sighs> Fire Emblem Three Hooses, um, Killer Seven, Ace Combat Seven, Near Replicant One Point Two. Oh yeah, Near Replicant, The Void, and Legacy of Kane Soul Reaver. All right, is that out yet? Is that back on Steam? I guess we'll find out when we get closer to it. Anyway, see you all later. Have a good rest of your week. Like I said, enjoy Tears of the Kingdom if you are partaking. If you're not, then you are based, as you know. See you later. Do -do 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 -do